Hello guys, this is interview prep. Hello world here. Today we are going to discuss the lead code problem, maximum profit in job scheduling. So let me explain about the problem. So this problem is given as we have n jobs where every job is scheduled to be done from a start time i to a start time j and the profit that you can obtain by scheduling this job is profit i. So we are given I start array and end array and the profit array so what we need to do is like we need to output the maximum profit that we can make by scheduling any subset of these jobs such that no two jobs in that subset is means like I are, are overlapping with each other so that is our job to do so one thing you can do like uh, for each job i we have two options either we can schedule it or we can leave it so if you schedule it then we have to find the previous jobs that are not intersecting with this job and if we are not to schedule this job then we can just take the uh, profit that we have obtained by not scheduling this that is equal to like scheduling job till i minus 1 if you are not scheduling the ith job then our maximum profit would going to be like the maximum profit that we have earned by scheduling jobs till i minus 1 so it is it seems like a classical problem of dp and we can slightly if we ap apply like uh, dp then it is going to be n square but n square algorithm can also be optim optimized by using binary search for searching the previous jobs that that can be scheduled with ith job so we can use binary search for that so binary search reduces the time complexity from n square to n log n so that approach i am going to discuss here so let's jump to the prob solution so first we will take the size of jobs start time dot length then we will create an array dp dpi is profit that we can make up to job i in this way dp0 is going to be like okay that we can decide later first we have to create a structure kind of thing that will hold all the three things so class you can say it node and start and end and profit we can say PR uh, node and S and A and P this dot start S. this dot P equal to now we will create this array array of nodes node i equal to new node start time i end time i and profit i we can now we can create a comparator for sorting the node
b dot end otherwise a dot start not start what happen now we can sort that node array arrays dot sort node and this comparator so we know that the profit that we can and here we will try to schedule the job in reverse order actually first we will schedule uh, the last well, first we will try to schedule the last job and let us see so here we can dp n minus 1 is going to be like node n minus 1 dot pr for int i equal to n minus 2 i greater than 0 i minus minus we will try to search the index of the previous compatible job with this ith index so for that i will use binary search let's say binary search so we will pass here this node array and we will pass n time uh, node i dot and and yes two things are sufficient i think and we can take that index here we will try to find the index of job compatible with this and for that we will check if index we will calculate profit here and profit that we can make if index equal equal to minus one then simply it is zero otherwise it should be dp index so our so our dpi would going to be math dot max dot max dpi plus one or prof plus node i dot pr dot profit yes this is here pr as well and we will return simply here dp0 now we have to implement this binary search function and we yes node array and where and start yes to start and end equal to error dot length minus one and answer equal to minus one while start is less than equal to end we will calculate mid here and equal to start plus and minus start 
divided by 2 start so we will check if if or a mid dot start is greater than or equal to well then we will update our answer to be mid and our end would be mid minus one else start equal to mid plus one we return answer from here okay now we will test it yes it is working so let's test on another test case start is this and is this and profit is let's run this now let's try to submit this problem yes this is accepted so hope you have enjoyed this video for more prime video and their solution please do subscribe my channel like share and comment i will keep on posting some prime solutions on this thank you for watching